Welcome to this prayer. This is a prayer I put together where I'd like to pray for anyone within the sound of my voice. All I ask you to do is to agree with me as I pray, and together we will seek our Heavenly Father. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we gather together and come into agreement in the wonderful and powerful name of Jesus Christ. Where two or more gathered, there you'll be in the midst of us. And anything we agree upon as touching, you will surely do. Father, in Jesus' name, there's no distance in the Spirit. And we thank you for the person I'm praying for who desires this prayer to you. Father God, they come before you humbly, seeking your divine guidance and intervention in the realm of their thoughts. They acknowledge that their thoughts have the power to shape their reality, and they implore you to help them align their mind with your perfect will. Father, they recognize that the battlefield of the mind is a place where spiritual warfare takes place. The enemy seeks to infiltrate their thoughts with lies, doubt, and negativity, but they stand firm in the knowledge that your spirit within them is greater than any force that may come against them. Holy Spirit, they invite you to help them take control of their thought life. They surrender their mind to you, asking that you would cleanse it from all impure and unrighteous thoughts. Help the person I'm praying for to take every thought captive and make it obedient to Christ. Lord, they confess that they may have allowed their mind to wander into territories that are not pleasing to you. They may have entertained thoughts of fear, worry, and anxiety, forgetting that you have promised to take care of all their needs. They repent of these thoughts and ask for your forgiveness. Heavenly Father, they long to think right thoughts that are in line with your truth. They yearn for a mind that is filled with love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. These are the fruits of your Spirit, and they desire to bear them abundantly in their thought life. God, they ask that you would help them to guard their mind diligently. Protect them from the lies of the enemy and the distractions of the world. Give them discernment to recognize when a thought is not aligned with your word and empower them to reject it swiftly. Lord, they thank you for the power of your word. Your word is a lamp under their feet and a light unto their path. They ask that you would speak your truth into their mind as they read the Bible, filling it with wisdom, understanding, and knowledge. Help them to meditate on your word day and night, allowing it to transform their thinking. They pray for a renewed mind. Take away any negative or limiting beliefs that they have held onto. Replace them with thoughts of faith, hope, and confidence in your plans for their life. Help them to see themselves as you see them, as a beloved child of God, fearfully and wonderfully made. God, they surrender their thoughts of control and surrender them to your divine will. Remind them that your ways are higher than their ways and your thoughts are higher than their thoughts. Help them to trust in your perfect timing and to lean not on their own understanding. Lord, the person I'm praying for asks for your grace and strength to resist the temptations of the flesh. When sinful thoughts arise, empower them to turn away and fix their mind on things that are pure, lovely, and praiseworthy. Fill their mind with thoughts that bring glory and honor to your name. How they long to have a mind that is steadfast and focused on you. They yearn for a mind that is filled with gratitude and thanksgiving even in the midst of trials and challenges. Help them to cultivate a heart of gratitude and to think on all the ways you have blessed them. Father, they know that they cannot transform their thoughts on their own. They need your supernatural intervention. They need your Holy Spirit to guide them 
and empower them to think right thoughts. Right thoughts lead to right believing. Right believing leads to right thinking. And right thinking leads to right actions that please you. They surrender their mind to you, knowing that you are faithful to complete the work you have started in them. We believe and receive everything we've prayed and give you glory in advance, for this prayer is answered. In the wonderful and precious name of Jesus we pray. Amen.